week with cheques presented for nearly £100,000, but who got the vote in last night's head-to-head? -head? Well, a project called Crossing the Pennines went up against food on the run. Let's see who won. Well, it's a very grey and miserable day on the Pennines today. Very foggy, a little bit chilly too, but luckily I've got everything I need to spread a little sunshine. Waterproof jacket, check. Walking boots, check. Very large, check. Let's skip to the good bit. We've got the members of the Milestone Society and some of the children from Marsden Junior School here. Hello, children, you all right? Yeah. Excellent. Are you hoping for some good news? Yeah. Well, that's good because... I've got some very good news. I have the largest of checks you've ever seen. Just grab hold of that tollkeeper, Meg. Open it up and let's see what we've got. Milestone Society, what does it say? How much? £49,200. Hey, we hey. can restore the back horse track. Can we all go? <laughs> <laughs> hey, we've done it! We've Hooray. done it! So tell us, how are you going to spend this money wisely, I hope? Very wisely. It's a restore a very ancient pack horse track, 1500s 1600s pack horse track, and it'll do it authentically with proper stone, not just geotextile and gravel. So it's a wonderful, wonderful thing to happen for bringing people into the valley, to Marsden, Slough it, Upper Mill. Thank you. Well, as they always say, the only good thing to come out of Lancashire is the road to Yorkshire, and this will go a long way towards restoring that to its former glory. Just one last thing for the children. A nice big thank you to everyone who voted. One, two, three. Thank you! Oh, and thanks to Fraser for presenting the cheque. So many congratulations to the Milestone Society there. And it's